Hi guys, I'm back with another video. This kind of video is, um, it's, well, at the moment, probably um, I'll be, probably do another video after this straight, straight after I've done this. This one's been uploaded, but yeah, this one's just more of just random stuff sort of thing. So yeah, I thought I'd just make it, make one, anyways. <laughs> I would say I was kind of bored. I was still just we just like a few like moments ago. I was on um my um uh lively lively live musically app lively musically app musically app sort of thing. I was on live there. I had not too many views, but but two views pretty much really. But yeah, and stuff. My dad came in and it was end. He might come in again. Probably on this one. Probably. When you come put downstairs and stuff, eh? so um, yeah. Um, let's see what to talk about. Um, hmm. yeah. as you can obviously would be tell, I'm not like up like where I would you normally know, be in my best upstairs in my bedroom. I'm downstairs in the kitchen and stuff. So there's more space and it's more like like bright light and stuff. So yeah. If we have been sort of up to date, like some of the stuff I've been places, like just like, hmm, I don't go about two hours, or three hours ago, I posted uh, um, another gaming video, like part five of the Sonic Speed Forces, Speed Speed Battle Forces, and that sort of thing. I'm just doing parts, you know, like when you like see the because you see them like level up, go up to level one, like, I don't know if that's your maximum level, but it's level 10 or whatever, but yeah, I'm just not, you know, like that, um, what else was going to say, uh, hang on, sorry, that's just my dad, just go, go, go past the kitchen, go into the front room, Okay, good. It's in there. Yeah. Um. I was gonna say. Yes. I'm now just recently watched the latest episode of uh, VB Volume Five, Chapter Five, I believe. Volume Five, Chapter. F yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Volume Five, Chapter Five. Honestly. I would say this week, really, this was really, really good. Like how you get um, like um, Yang's mom, Raven, who's the leader of the bandits, 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 bandits. There you go. So for my Eng my English back 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 of spelling, bandit bandits. So I will get it right at some point. <laughs> yeah, um like she's uh telling the truth to the young and wise about about um us Professor Ospin and also Crow. Like she inside them, she inside with her and you know, that her way is like, you know and stuff. And then all Yang thinks about is is literally more concerns about her obviously uh, the safety of her young baby sister Ruby make sure that she's safe and that as she literally left home left the night left home without saying anything to to um Yang her dad obviously their dad was was quite wired right but it's a good thing that Yang went after Ruby you know, after finally tracking down her mum, but Ruby's mum is dead. Obviously, we all know that some ways. <laughs> so yeah, and what Wise? When Wise heard the truth from Yang's mum, Raven, I could tell by looking in her face. Do it. Oh yeah. When um Yang asked Wise, you don't honestly believe what my mum was. What, what obviously what her, what Yang's mum was saying, right? Like the truth, the truth is the truth, you know. And why is reaction? I can just just tell by just looking. She that that literally believes what 
Gardens when was, was telling about Ospin and Crow and you know, but all Yam was worried about was Ruby. Nothing else didn't want to like stay like you know to try and restart a new life for um, like mum, like you know, get to know each other because if you're because I do understand why she, why, obviously why Raven wants to, because she wants to get them to know their daughter, daughter a bit more, and try and like make, make up for mistakes she made by like leaving her when she was young, not calling, uh, not writing a letter, or even like when it was obviously when it was young, as young as young as growing up, saying happy birthday to when it, when it was her birthday, saying you know happy birthday. So yeah, but then the gang, I understand the reason why she didn't want to because obviously if you mum or dad left you from a young age and then you finally actually get like tracked down and then, and then they say yes, they we want to like we, we start a new life with you and try to get to know you a bit more. You gang, she had in her mind, like if she did that, she was thinking that her mum was going to obviously run off you again without saying a word, literally. So I understand both sides. You know, like, and I do feel for, sorry for it, but obviously in reality for those who have, actually have to have parents, but grew up, but probably with both, and then after like a certain age, one of them leaves, or that, you know, and then uh, see them again when they get older. And then tell them this and that, and then the parent says, Yeah, they do want to. And then obviously, the, the person or some door doesn't want to give them, you know, another chance because they blew it the first time. What makes they're thinking, they, What would they should, should they give them their, you know, parents another chance, second chance because they think they blow it up again. So, yeah. Um, that's kind of like, I don't even know what sort of title I would actually, um, call this, probably, I don't know, you'll soon see, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I was just watching, like, random YouTube videos, uh, like, some YouTuber, like, um, doing a reaction on, um, uh, cheapest, um, mum ever, so pretty much, like, I, I didn't watch all the videos. All, all of the footage could I like change to like another video, YouTuber on like another certain video but this one right pretty much so I think she's living over in America or somewhere and she um she has a boyfriend they have two kids she she has one one bob in her house in, in the house so pretty much so so, so she's she thinks that she's I would say, truthfully, she is saving electric money on electricity. So it's still like like how you get most families who live in a house with like about two or three to four kids, or even one kid, yeah, right? And they have like light bulbs, lights, every in the house, for, light bulbs for every single sort of thing, right? So this woman has just one bulb, so when she needs to go for like, um, for example, from the kitchen to go to like, bathroom to toilet or whatever, takes the right bulb, switches, puts on the black one, you know, just one bulb. So when she, and I do understand, that's kind of a really good way to save electricity, but then again, if you had friends, family members staying over, that's kind of, um, I think it's kind of, it's kind of probably silly, stupid, dumb, whatever. Not like really good idea, especially if they, you know, wake up. Like especially if the kids like light bulbs were like all the way downstairs in the front room. There's no light upstairs, and the kids like in the middle of the night wake up to go to the toilet. Oh my gosh, how to go upstairs and get the light bulb, switch it out, take it upstairs, put it in the toilet light, uh, light um, bit, so, so I can use the toilet. All in the landing. Come on, it's all, all the hallway, whatever you guys call it. But yeah, I just find it was ridiculous. Knowing that later on, 
I saw some other footage. One of them was um when um she was at the supermarket. She was standing there. She had um you know like the fruit and vegetable like uh, plastic bags, right? When you get like if you pick it up like like apples, bananas, or even like the peppers, and then you'd like go and weigh them, right, on the scale. She was literally standing there with the plastic thing, picking the grapes out of out of the um, actual packet that actually were putting them into the into the bag, and and she said, "I why should, I only need to pay for what I need, but not what I don't, need, what she doesn't need." And I'm thinking that's kind of silly. You're literally wasting grapes. You truly might be thinking save money there, but no, you're wasting grapes. And then and there's one with the banana. She uh, took off one banana, peeled the whole thing off, and then put it into a plastic bag. And and, and I'm like, and there was uh, somebody in the shop who saw her, who was a customer. Yeah, one of those customers saw her, and, and she was like, I've never seen anybody do that. And this is the first time I've seen this as well. And I just think that's just, and right, this one, right? Um, the last bit of footage is when, um, she, they had uh, family members, friends and family members over. Uh, the friend, when she had asked to go to the um, toilet, bathroom, whatever, she had asked for um, one of those ca uh, bathroom candles to go, just so she could see where she's going and all that and stuff. I just think that's, that's not, it's, Ridiculous, it's insane. And again, knowing that, she um, went into the um, kitchen. Uh, she took out and um, pulled out um, one of those uh, like, kind of like baking tray in a way, in a way sort of thing. Uh, it was out of, straight out of the dish, dishwasher, or I believe it was in the, it was satin, right? She really pre-made a lasagna I believe or something like that, and put it straight into the thing and, it's the gut, and one of the guy uh, I was her boyfriend's brother was eating it he said it tastes like um what was it wash like washing up um or something like dishwasher or whatever something like that and so it's like she true she might be thinking she's saving electricity save money and electricity but still you don't like do that with the, um food hygiene oh yes one last one the food bit when um there was a bit where she was like if the her boyfriend or, or her kids don't eat the rest of the food so for example like the, if they have like mayonnaise ketchup or bonnets she puts script the rest of the spawn is back into the into the actual jar where it came out of, even though it's already been used, been like been you know food's been in there. So mayonnaise, put it into mayonnaise bowl, um, bottle or jar, whatever. I just find that kind of hygiene. And not only that, forks, pl plastic forks in that. Instead of having like you know spoon and knife and fork, she has plastic forks. Instead of like throwing them away and having new fresh ones. She just like clean, clean them, and and then put put them in like and reuse them. That's just hygiene. That is nasty, disgusting hygiene. Because if I was the boyfriend, I would have definitely, literally, right, before I actually stayed with, her, with the person, with her, or even you know. I would have found out first, done my research. If I found out that's how she was, I was like, right, no, this is this is I would like, you know, or like found out later on, straight later on down the line, I would go right. We need to change this, or I'm leaving. Stuff like that. I'm I'm glad I'm I'm not like that because that's not how I was raised. So I'm just thinking back in my mind, how was she raised? Is that really how she was raised, or is that how she was thinking when she was? growing up gotten older literally <laughs> but yeah honestly and then um, 
other YouTube video well stuff to do on like Pokemon like this one about the top ten worst signed Pokemon and then how to fix them. <laughs> but anyway, um yeah, that one because it was said uh, cheapest mom cheapest mom ever. That was the title of the thing. So if you want to actually know the full thing even more details, go watch on YouTube. <laughs> type type in cheapest mom ever. Honestly. And there's uh, some of the ones where it's uh, what's about um worst mums worst mums ever or something they like what the mums did to the kids or something. I didn't probably watch that one. So I can't really give you that much details on that one. And then there was one other no two others I'll say. One of them was do with a guy no yeah yeah it was it was actually yes no actually yes it's the exact same thing actually it was uh pranks gone gone too far so uh, it, one of them I, I wouldn't say this is a prank but then again it could be it was a black guy tall skinny black guy he was standing there he had his like probably baby he obviously was a baby, don't know if it was like his son, cousin, niece, whatever, nephew, whatever. Had him, had the baby in, on his arm, right? And, and he was literally, he had a plate on top of the baby and the food on top. And then he was eating like a, one of those chocolate Twinkies, Twinkie bar, cake bar, whatever. Off the plate, while well, the plate was on top of the baby, I just find that's just because he could have easily could have dropped the baby, and the baby could have gone head brain damage, something like that, which you should never do with a baby. That's unsafe. And there's another one. Well, this is more of actually, even though it is kind of literally prank, but it's probably too far. Uh, this guy, this dude, got, um, well, um, I think it was, uh, uh, chili pepper on his, uh, I think it was his girlfriend's or wife's, yeah, I think it was, yeah, on his girlfriend's, one of his girlfriend's tampons. On, on all over then, then then put it back in put the tampon back in and then after and then obviously his girlfriend used it and then honestly she was like what's happening what's happening to me and I'm not going to say anything else because that's not going on my video on here <laughs> I don't do those kind of like you know or put those dirty things on here so I was, when I saw it, I was like, whoa, I would never do that. But true, it's funny at first, it's a good idea, but you should never go do it, take it too far like that and stuff. So yeah. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, this poem was pretty much be like a random, random talk video. I didn't expect it to be this long, but probably try and make another one but it'll be a short one a quick short one probably the next one will be straight up this so i'm now gonna go and then i'll be probably back soon so if you really like this kind of video and you want more or you want me to react to any like uh video youtube videos feel feel free to comment down below Subscribe to subscribe uh, subscribe to my channel if you want more videos like this. Peace out. Yeah. Deuces.